Okay, go ahead. Why are we going out today? We are going out to remove the rolling moss and other offending shrubberies off of the clams. If you didn't check on them, eventually the uh, the net would just build up with um, algae and, and weeds and, and, and shrubs until it blocked the water flow. And so there would be no more dissolved oxygen for the clams to, to breathe. A little clam massacre. So rolling moss is, um, it is exactly what it looks like. It's so many different types of plant life from algae to seaweed to weeds to, to moss and they just kind of mass together and roll around like some sort of horrible uh, uh, aquatic tumbleweed. And what do you do if there is rolling moss? You remove it. We're gonna go down there and hit it with a big old hose. If the nets are clogged, we use amazing amounts of fantastic water pressure to gently move all of the offending rolling moss to another location. So we can try to clean it, you can scrub it, um, or you can use the water pressure. But if both of those fail, just because it's so fuzzy, then you just go ahead and roll that one up and replace it with a brand new one. Yeah, about two years in, they will be to such a size, most of them, that most of the predators can't uh, eat them anymore. There's a few, but uh, you know we're, we're gonna go ahead and just let them be part of the ecosystem at that point, take the net off and let them settle down and have uh, beautiful clam babies. Perfect. Thank you. So how will this work? You're just gonna chop it up? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And so it'll be like me going, 